New at 6, the Denver Police Union has a message for the person who called 911 threatening to gun down cops in the streets. Jennifer Kovaleski live in Aurora. And Jennifer, tonight you have that call and you also talked to the Aurora chief about these threats. Eric, the Aurora police chief says he is taking extra steps to make sure his officers are safe after this chilling 911 call threatening to kill police. It is time that you guys know we are no longer playing around with the police departments. Aurora and Denver, we were about to start striking fear, shooting down all cops that we see by themselves. Denver police and the Arapahoe County Sheriff's Office are also aware of the threat and taking extra measures. No one is saying exactly what they are. Hours after the creepy 911 call, Aurora police were called to a scene and officers were shot at off 19th and Florence. Luckily, no one was hurt and police do not believe it's related to the threat. Nick Rogers is a detective with the Denver Police Department. He says this isn't the first time officers have been threatened and it won't change how they do their jobs. I'm not hiding. We're not going to hide from you. If you have the guts to do something like that, God forbid you try that on my watch. I mean, any time somebody is willing to either one, um, proactively and, and without any kind of provocation, attack one of our officers or, for that matter, call in what we consider to be a very serious threat, we're going to take that very seriously. The Aurora police chief says the caller went to a lot of trouble to disguise their identity and keep their number anonymous. The chief is now dedicating additional resources to find the person who did this. The alarming call comes after a wave of anti-police movements across the country. Live in Aurora tonight, Jennifer Kovaleski, 7 News.